The actor Stephen Tompkinson has been found not guilty of assaulting a man outside his home. Uh, the 57-year-old star of DCI Banks, uh, he was accused of punching a man who was drunkenly making noises outside the actor's home in the early hours of May the 30th in 2021. That's two years ago. Um, and uh, we obviously got a huge amount of detail in... Uh, during the trial, jurors heard that the two men had been drinking uh, since midnight that bank holiday Sunday. Uh, they were told that the, the two men had gone to the beach before passing Stephen Tompkinson's home in Whitley Bay in North Tyneside on the walk back. And uh, jurors heard as well that the actor who was living with his partner and her seven-year-old son at the time uh, said he heard some strange noises, went out to challenge the two who were described uh, by him as heavily intoxicated and uh, he said he called 999 after seeing the pair trying to stand up and fall several times while drinking from a bottle of Jägermeister and also Meister rather. And, and also uh, during the trial, he said that uh, while he was waiting to be connected, he went outside and told the pair that he was calling the police. Um, so uh, Stephen Tompkinson also told the court that the two men took great objection to him complaining and had started to move towards him. And during the trial, his evidence was that he'd put his hand out to stop Mr Poole coming any further. That was one of the two men outside his house and made contact with his face. But he told jurors it wasn't enough to knock a sober man off his feet. And clearly, uh, jurors agreed with Stephen Tompkinson in this case. And he has been found not guilty at Newcastle Crown Court of inflicting grievous bodily harm. So let's get some more details now. Outside the court is uh, our correspondent, Katerina Vitozzi. So, Katerina, what more can you tell us? Well, in the end, <clears throat> excuse me, in the end, Anna, this was a unanimous decision by the jury who spent only about two hours deliberating, sent out shortly after three o'clock yesterday afternoon. Uh, as I say, a unanimous not guilty verdict from them. They believed the defence's argument that the actor Stephen Tompkinson did little more than put his hand out in self-defence uh, and then that Carl Poole, one of the two men who had been outside his house drunk, they, they admitted that they were, uh, had fallen over uh, and, and hit his head on the pavement as a result of that act. The prosecution throughout had claimed that the actor in there, in, in his interaction with the two drunk men outside his house May last year, simply snapped. They say that he, he slapped and, and punched Mr Poole and that is what led to him falling over the defence saying that that simply wasn't the case and the jury here as I say taking just about two hours or so to come to that not guilty verdict on the charge of grievous bodily harm. Now the actor who was 57 uh, had been at home at the time with his partner and, and, their, and, his, uh, and her child, their seven year old child and the actor said uh, in the course of uh, this trial that he simply wouldn't have acted in an aggressive way because of the nature of his celebrity he said why would I risk all that I have worked hard for in in a moment of madness uh, the defense uh, the jury agreeing with that versions of events here at Newcastle Crown Court unanimously finding Stephen Tompkinson the actor known for well those of a certain vintage will remember him from programs such as Ballycus Angel but more recently things like DCI Banks and um, found not guilty here today of that charge of grievous bodily harm